Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Paja and today's video is going to be another H&M haul. I do apologize again for my voice. I know it sounds a bit groggy. I'm still kind of recovering from my illness. I've kind of got a blocked nose. So I do apologize for that. But I hope you like my lipstick. Today it is Fenty and I've just put a little bit of gloss just to make it a bit more, you know, mm, shiny. And the top that I'm wearing, isn't it so much fun, so, so beautiful. Got it from Zara, I love it. It's extra over the top, just like my personality. But without further ado, let's get straight into the Zara haul. Ooh, oh, it's H&M haul. <laughs> the first item that I got was a two-piece, and it's like a knitted two-piece. It's still kind of a bit cold outside, so we do need to still kind of keep warm. At the weekend, it was just raining all weekend. This would look so cute with like some boots, you know, like proper ankle boots, like mid mid ankle boots, like no heel, or like like this heel, like oh that would look so good. <laughs> so this is the top of the two piece, and it's just a nice little jumper and a lovely little light brown color. But what I loved about it was the button detail. I love buttons. I just think they really make an outfit pop. They're a great little accessory. And I don't know, I just, I've always been captivated when it comes to buttons. The buttons are only on one sleeve and then they are on my left side. Um, and the other side has no buttons. But yeah, how beautiful. Really good material. It's not super amazing material, but it's, it's decent quality. I would say it's midway. You know, it's just the thing of not overwashing it um that's what i would probably say i don't think it's going to last long if you over overwash it so this is um on the conscious con conscious conscious i said conscious <laughs> this is conscious so it is um recycled polyester free from consumer waste and pre-consumer waste which is really important you know the fashion world industry is now thinking about their effect on the the world and you know their global impact um, and that companies are looking at what they could do to improve which is important because ultimately we're not going to stop shopping and buying things and buying new items that's just not realistic but if companies source really good fabrics from and think about the effect of the, where they're sourcing things that is just amazing it means a win-win for everyone but yeah lovely jumper I got this in a size small and then the matching skirt So got a nice elastic waist, it means it's going to fit nice on our waist. And then again, one side has the buttons and then we've got a little bit of a slit, Ooh, showing off just a little bit. Really like the colour of this, just a, looks like nearly to my skin colour. But yeah, it's really, really pretty. I think it's going to be a nice cosy outfit. Got this again in a size small, really loving it. The material isn't too heavy as well, you can definitely wear this across into spring. It's gonna look nice. I'm super excited to try this on for you guys. Okay, so is that brown two-piece on. Really love it. It's so comfy, but so stylish as well. It just feels like lazy and like effortless, but I feel really, really good and like I feel glam and stylish. So you've got that button effect on this side, and you know, it's just naturally just want you want to show off that shoulder. We love that. And then we've got the slit at the bottom here show off a little bit of leg and the bun effect continues on on that left side of myself yeah good elastic and then you can just you know keep it casual i love this piece i feel like it could be a nice like little date outfit wear some trainers you know have some nice natural makeup and you know just be showing off everything <laughs> but not anything does that make sense you're not showing off any like boobs or bum but you are still like showing off your curves and showing that you still have a good figure but yeah i really really like this next up to match my beautiful red lips from fenty beauty i got a beautiful red lace dress from h&m beautiful 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 i love chiffon although it can be a bit of annoying material because it's very see-through and that is what i'm seeing already um, I just love the material she found. It's just so lovely and light and breathable. Okay, so it has been um, layered up, so the front isn't as um, exposing and see-through as the back. Do like that. Nice deep V. I love that the front here. 
you know that material has kind of been like what's that I don't know what it's called but do you know what I mean like the material has kind of been pressed in a certain way like to look like this yeah and then the sleeves as well the ends it looks really really pretty and it feels really really great as well and it's got a nice little belt I am not giving this justice, just, just like just holding it up and stuff, but it's gonna look nice on, I promise. I got it in a size 8, and yeah, I just like it. And it looks nice and short as well, because I am a short girl. Like sometimes I wear long dresses, the dress is wearing me, I'm not wearing the dress. <gasps> this is so beautiful, isn't it? I love a good dress where I can spin. <laughs> And it flows with me. I really, really love the color of it. I love chiffon. I just think it's so cute. Works amazing with the red lip. I love the skirt. Isn't it just stunning? And it doesn't look like H&M at all. Like if I saw this, I would not think H&M. I I'll think it's a lot more expensive, pricier. But it does really depend on how you style it and what else you wear. But yeah, I love it. It's cute. Where would I wear it? I don't even know. <laughs> I don't know where I'll wear it, but I just think it's beautiful. Continuing on with dresses and floral prints, because I am a girly girl and I love floral prints. <laughs> I've got this other black dress. Okay. Oh, why is it so hard to open? Alright, H&M, you want to step up the game by, you know, getting con con conscious fashion? Conscious fashion? H&M, you want to separate your game by getting conscious fashion. Next thing you need to do is get rid of the plastic, girl. Get rid of it. Go like Zara and just put the stuff in the in the that recyclable um box and yeah, just make our lives easier as well. Okay, I do not remember this at all. Okay, it's a nice little long sleeve dress. Ooh, it's really cute. A lovely chiffon material. Love the print of it. It's got a lovely little um pink and red flowers over it and just a nice little black dress this is a very versatile dress it can be worn in so many different occasions you could wear it to church you could wear it to work you could wear it on a little date you know just how you dress it up maybe you wear tights maybe you go bare legged really really pretty maybe some heels maybe some flats i love how versatile it is it's got some nice little ruffle effect in the front and it's very conservative you're covering up everything and then you've got a little Popper here in the front. You can expose more if you want, I guess. <laughs> or you can be a bit more conservative and cover it all up. But yeah, I really, really like this. Really, really nice and fun. Got this in a size UK 8. And I don't have any of the prices. You'd have to check that, that out online. So Here is that black floral dress. It's a bit shorter than the other one, but it's still really conservative. But still really girlish and fun. Like you don't have to feel um, that if you're covering up, you you can't still be cute. You can't still be sexy. You can cover up and still be beautiful. Like you don't need to show off everything. I love the dress. Really really nice. Just cutesy, isn't it? But yeah, I feel really comfortable and sexy still with everything covered up, only exposing my leg. <laughs> I need to really shave those though. But yeah, really cute little dress, lots of ruffle detail, a nice chiffon, but it's really nicely layered and then you've got the underlining as well. That feels great quality, um, feels really comfy and I don't feel like I will be like overheat heating like um, in the summertime. I feel like I'll still be quite cool and calm. And I'll show you the back too. Just a cute little dress. Next up was a skirt in like a trench material. I am really loving my skirts lately just because they're fun and girly. And you know what? I'm just more confident in my body, especially my legs. I used to be really self conscious about my legs. But yeah, ooh, it's a little pretty trench skirt. It's not quite a long one. It looks mahoosive. <laughs> But I guess it hasn't got any stretch to it, so it's going to look bigger than like a dress that has a give. So the waist is really nice. I like like how it's been layered. And then you definitely have that trenched out belt. I 
effect in the front and then you've got the buttons as well material is really hard not a soft material as at all but it's a proper trench coat material i like this a lot i got this in a uk6 Ooh, why did i get a uk6 maybe it was the only thing that was in stock it's got a slit in the front as well i think it's gonna be fun you know you can do a lot with that next up was a white top Right now I've seen the white top, it looks see-through, so I think I'm not going to like it. I don't like items that are see-through. I like things to be thicker and I'm happy just to pay a bit more to have an item that is not see-through. So, mm, it's just a nice little basic top. But yeah, look at that. You can see the label underneath it. It's a no-go. It's not doing it for me at all. But it's cute little basic top. And I got this in a size small. Here is that skirt and top on. I know the top is not with this outfit. And I also know the skirt is a bit too small for me. Ah, I should have gone eight, but I think it was out of stock. And I just thought, oh my god, let me just try because it, it looks so beautiful. The skirt, I'm in love with it, but oh, I think it's out of stock. It's such a great quality material and it looks so good. I need an eight. Because it's good around the waist, the six, and the hips are okay, but it feels like the buttons are a bit bulgy. They don't look comfortable and like straight, so it looks a bit odd. It looks like it's too tight for me, but I love this look. Just a different top. I have a nice top from Zara. I'll just wear that one instead. But yeah, I like the look still. Maybe if I lose some weight. <laughs> Last but not least was a jumper. Sometimes you just want to be lazy and, you know, cozy up in a nice cute jumper. And sometimes you haven't got a boyfriend to go to his house and steal jumpers from. Sometimes you have to buy your own jumpers. So I got this kind of like ugly grey colour jumper. It's just not really like a bright colour at all. That's just why I think I really liked it. It's nice and dull and like just gives off that vibe of being lazy. <laughs> So here it is, got a bit of black and white, you know, give it a bit more of a colourful effect, <coughs> make it a bit less bland, but yeah, just, you know, but yeah, anyways, I got this in a size extra small and super excited about that. Here is that, I stole my boyfriend's jumper, jumper on, really casual, super nice and comfy. It's not too thick, so really good for this weather where it's kind of getting a bit warmer. But yeah, just a nice little casual piece that will be worn out to death. You can wear it so many different places, in the house and outside the house as well. It does have a hoodie. Just no notice that one of my curls is showing. I spent like four hours curling this hair. I went outside for one hour and I lost all my curls. But look how beautiful and lustrous it was before. And then now it's just like this. Horrible, right? Horrible. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoy the items that I got from H&M. I do apologize that I haven't had as much bubble, bubble, bubbly energy as I usually have. Just because I'm sick, I'm just tired and, you know, I end up having to cough a lot in the videos and it just makes it awkward because I have to, like, delete them and... Uh, anyways, I hope you still like the video. Give it a thumbs up for just my effort for uploading whilst I'm ill. Subscribe to the channel because I do do better videos where I am more hyperactive and more like personality why like they have more personality. Oh my god, my head. I have an ill head. Anyways, bye.